welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the Falcon 64 project. Today I have a short little project for you. Um, disassembling the upper control arm. Getting it ready for new ball joints and uh, getting it ready for powder coating. So let's move on and check this project out. So here's the upper control arm. I took it out yesterday. Um, if you look at the, uh, the videos before, it would be the one right before this one. It should be. Anyways, I got everything loosened up, but I haven't disassembled it yet. So, here we have the spring perch. Um, as you can tell, it does not move. Upper control arm, our ball joint, still in pretty decent shape. And then the rod, obviously no sprinkler, uh, or no uh, sprinkler, no grease zerk fittings. So let's get on. I'm going to first start by removing the sprinkler. Uh, I believe this is just a 9 16 And there's your spring perch. Um, obviously, this is just going to be garbage. I do like to try to save the hardware, but I can get that out later. And then we have the upper ball. That is a half inch. trying to hold it in. There's a grease irk. It's also contained. Really this isn't in bad shape but I mean except for the rip boot. Definitely needs to be replaced now that I see that. And lastly we got the rod. So um, trying to disassemble this sucker I soaked it in PB blaster because yesterday I could not get this thing undone. So uh, for this, the biggest thing I had was a Metrix 32. I'm using a big uh, two foot breaker bar. Like I said, I already did loosen these up. You didn't want to see me fight with this thing. And there. So that's all the pieces of the uh, upper control arm. So now, I can throw this in the, in the blaster, the bead blaster, blast all the crap. Well, first I'm gonna hit it with a wire brush. I find a wire brush, uh, uh, air grinder, takes off the majority of it, and then I can just hit it with a, uh, and the bead blaster, and it's ready to rock on. Then I can powder coat it. Um, don't know what color I'll go with here, but it'll probably be a burgundy or black. Um, and go from there. The lower control arms, I'm not even gonna mess with. Unless, I don't know, I might mess with those and uh, bust those loose, because those are pretty easy as well. Um, I'm gonna get new uh, spring purchase with the uh, roller bearings inside, so that should help out a lot. As you can tell, those suckers are frozen up and need to be replaced. Anyways, 
thanks for watching again please subscribe if you have any questions hit me up and uh, I'll catch you next time